Christ to the Nations and the Nations to the Church. Daily Devotions from Lutheran Hour Ministries. Friday, May 6th, 2022. What the Bible is like. This devotion pairs with this weekend's Lutheran Hour sermon of the same title, which can be found at lutheranhour.org. The text is 2 Timothy chapter 3, verses 16 and 17. All Scripture is breathed out by God and profitable for teaching, for reproof, for correction, and for training in righteousness, that the man of God may be complete, equipped for every good work. What is the second best-selling book of all time? Imagine the contest for the best-selling book of all time were a race. If the race for the world's best-selling book were a marathon, then the winner would be crossing the 26.2-mile finish line before second place got to mile four. And third place wouldn't even have made it a half a mile. In other words, in the race for the world's best-selling book, the winner is sprinting and the others are crawling. According to Russell Ash, author of the book series Top 10 of Everything, The second best-selling book of all time is a little red book published in China. It's titled, Quotations from Chairman Mao Zedong. It was first published in 1964. There have been around 900 million copies sold. In first place is the Bible, with over 6 billion copies sold, about seven times more than second place. Third place goes to J.R.R. Tolkien's Lord of the Rings, with just over 1% of the Bible's total sales. The race for the world's best-selling book isn't even close enough to be called a race. The Bible has no competitors, no peers in its class. That's because the Bible is God's book. The words of the Bible were breathed out by God himself. That's what one of the earliest followers of Jesus said, a Jewish man named Paul, writing to Timothy, his young co-worker in God's mission. Paul said the Bible is a God-breathed book, a book beneficial for teaching and correcting, for setting right and for training in what is right. It's a gift from God, given so that the person who follows God may be competent, equipped for every good work. Among all the books ever written, the Bible is clearly the winner. But it's not the kind of winner that is content to rest on a shelf like a trophy gloating and gathering dust. God's written word is like God's personal word, the word made flesh, Jesus, who came not to be served, but to serve. Mark chapter 10, verse 45. God inspired the Bible, not just to blow away the competition, but to serve us by sustaining our faith, hope, and love for Jesus and to nurture love for our neighbors. The Bible is the king of all books, the kind of king that would get up from the table, kneel to the ground, and wash our dirty feet. Please pray with me. Jesus, keep giving us your word as a lamp to our feet and a light for our path. Amen. Thank you.